I know I filmed Sawyer before, uh, before, but I like Sawyer a lot. Sawyer has been on 107.5. Uh, Sawyer is one year old, and um, six months. Five plus one, six months. Um, pretty sure Sawyer. I think Sawyer is a male. I'm pretty sure. Well, I think that Sawyer is a male. I'm not quite sure. But I like Sawyer a lot. Sawyer says, okay, quit talking about me and give me some goodies. Give me some food. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to give Sawyer some, some food. A little treat. Doesn't look like Sawyer has any water. Good doggy Sawyer. Yeah. Good kid Sawyer. Good doggy Sawyer. Yep. Sawyer was a little bit apprehensive about the camera. But good looking kid though. I have a feeling that Tiefer Southern. His name is Tiefer Southern. Very interesting. Tiefer Southern. Male, um, two years old, Tiefer Southern has been here for about five days now, I wonder if I can give Tiefer Southern a treat, Tiefer Southern looks kind of I would think that Tiefer Southern would be kind of suspicious of my camera. Yep, he is. He's pretty suspicious about the whole thing. He's not going to come forward. Maybe after time, then he'll get more comfortable with me and interact a little bit more. He's very, very unsure about things. I want to see if I can get a close-up of him. That was a pretty nice one. There's got to be something in there somewhere. It was Tifa. Tifa. There you go. I'm going to try this again. I'm kind of in, kind of being invasive here a little bit with Tifa, so... But Tifer has to use his sniffer and he'll find. Yeah. Good boy, Tifer. Yeah. That's a good. Oh, with the kisses? I like those kisses, Tifer. Yeah, good kisses, man. Yep. Yep. You're a good doggy, Tifer. Yes. Oh, with the tail wagging. I like that tail wagging, sweetie. Yep. Good doggy, Tifer. Hey, Tifer. Use your sniffer. There you go, sweetie. I think T. I think Tifer is probably a hound, some kind of a hound. <laughs> that would be what I would guess. Good looking dog, though. Getting some good eye contact every once in a while. Yeah. Okay, I'll show you some other ones. One of my favorite ones for a long time. L Lillian, or this is Liz, I mean. Liz. Liz has been on Channel 4 News and she's been on 107.5. She's been here September, since September, beginning of September, so she's been here about two months, a little over two and a half months now. Liz is three years old and six months, five plus one, six months. Um, 
Liz is very she's a very smart dog it's not like she's not like uh, the other dogs where she's you know easily won over by food or by treats or by by petting or anything like that that's really she's really she makes up her mind what she wants to do she doesn't let anybody control anything that how she feels I'm gonna throw a treat in there see if I can get Lazy's attention hey honey want a treat there? it depends on how comfortable she is she might not be interested sometimes if I put my hand out and she sees that as a, as a pleasant gesture and she might come forward or she might just stay there you know so but it all just depends yeah here she's coming forward good girl Liz yeah that was a good dog Liz yes you are yeah good dog Liz yeah good kid Liz you want another treat? let me give you let me give you another treat Liz Okay. Liz, like I said, Liz is very smart. She's very selective about, you know, what she does. Hey, honey. Sweetie pie. Here. She likes that treat. She's just... You know, uh, yeah, I, I'm reaching in there to see if, as a gesture of openness, trying to get, trying to see if she wants me to pet her, but you know, I don't know, honey. What do you think, sweetie? That's a good girl, Liz. Yeah. You are a good girl, Liz. You sure are. Good dog, Liz. Mm -hmm. That's a good girl. Mm -hmm. Yep, so there's Liz for you. There's Liz. Jasper. Jasper is three years old, male, um, he grabs a little bit, he grabs with the teeth a little bit, he's, um, so he's been here about two weeks, yeah, nice smile, I like that smile, yeah, he knows how to sit, too, he's a great, he's a great kid. Mm -hmm. Go Jasper. Yeah, good doggy Jasper. Let's see. There's another one of my favorite ones. Rosie over here. He's two years old, female. Um, one of the previous owner's kids. She was really good with the previous owner's kids. Tail wag. I like that tail wag, Mosey. I do. Good tail wag, Mosey. Yes. There you go. Good, Good girl. Yeah, I'm
That's Chloe. <laughs> Chloe is on the left. been here a couple days, only a couple days now. <laughs> Chloe is five months old, five months old. <laughs> and then, then uh, over here was Tokyo. And Tokyo was who I massaged yesterday. Tokyo, let's see. Might as well put this up. Tokyo has been here since the 29th, so he's been here about two weeks. Tokyo. Tokyo is a male. I don't know if I told you that yesterday or not. Sit. That's a good dog. Sit. Yep. Um. Tokyo didn't do good with a poodle, or with a puppy, I mean. But she's okay with dogs, I guess. Although she barked a little bit at uh, Chloe. I might give him a little treat here in a minute. Chloe's four years old. Uh, this this right here is Chloe is very excited very excited doggy uh, I'm going to see if I can get Chloe Chloe the Settle down a little bit. I would say, I think Chloe, Chloe is female. I think Chloe is with a, I think, like seven months or something like that. Not very, not very old at all. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna put some, put, yeah, put, put, uh, put the thing over here. Chloe is starving for attention. Very excited. Very excited. It's going to be a challenge to see if I can get Chloe to settle down a little bit. Pretty good time with Kong. You know, one of my one of my goals right now would be to try and get her to tire her out a little bit. 
And if I could do, if I could tire her out a little bit, then I might have more of a chance of getting getting a massage for her. She's got pretty good teeth, so I kind of have to be a little careful. Good doggy. Yes, good kid. Good kid. Yeah. Good kid. Yep. She's confused about whether she should bite me or bite Kong. Yeah, I think that's that's the that's the key is to have my finger in the hole. And then the hole of the Kong and then I can she can chew. I can still control the comp at the same time. And that way I don't get her teeth too much, as much as I was before. Yep. Ideally, I think it would be nice to get her in a yard, and that way I could, I could play with her a little bit. And get her tired, good and tired, before I tried to massage her because she's just so high strung right now. It's really hard for me to get a good massage from her. Get a good massage with her. Yep. But I'm gonna see in a minute if I can get her to just laying down on that bed, so I might be able to. I might be able to massage her a little bit while she's laying on the bed. And if she's fussing around with that car, then I might be able to help her out with that. Yeah. Yeah. You can bite that, but you can't bite my fingers. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Oh, sweet. Yeah. There you go, honey. Yeah. Oh. Yep, there you go. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, I really like it when she's biting the Kong instead of biting me. Biting my hand. She's getting a little bit tired now. Either that or I am. <laughs> I don't know. Yep. So, let me see. I'll see if maybe I can get a massage from her. I don't know. <laughs>
What did you do? Um, right. Brianna said that you'll have to get out of the kennels now because they're bringing dogs back from off site. Okay.